What's going on webheads and welcome to day 22 of Spider Pops 25 Days of Christmas Season 4. And today is a very special day. Not only is it 25 Days of Christmas, day 22, December 22nd is also Miss Spider Pops and I anniversary. Miss Spider Pops and I have been together now for two years officially. And I'm just so incredibly grateful for every single day I get to spend with Miss Spider Pops. She makes my life absolutely fantastic. And I could not ask for anybody better to spend my days with. She is absolutely amazing. And Miss Spider Pops, I love you with everything in my heart. But for today's Day 22 video, we actually do have a Wicked Webtastic Marvel Legends collectible to go over for all of you guys today. And it is something that Miss Spider Pops and I recently were actually out and about at our local Ross. And if you guys have never been to Ross, Ross is just a really interesting, I, I would like to call it like a clearance store just because the product they actually do get in is usually product that was new the year before. And since the product they're actually getting isn't brand new, they do usually clearance it for a relatively decent price. And that is exactly what happened today. When Miss Spider Pops and I were looking around at our local Ross, a few days ago, throughout the store, they had a whole bunch of toys and other collectibles and stuff scattered throughout. They had a whole bunch of Funko Pops. Every single Funko Pop I actually did see there was going for around like five bucks, which is absolutely crazy in and of itself. But the thing that we actually did end up picking up that caught my eye is this Marvel Legends Jonathan Hammer. Jonathan? I mean, this Marvel Legends Mjolnir Hammer from Thor Love and Thunder. That's right. We did actually pick up this absolutely insane Marvel Legends collectible from our local Ross today. When this thing first came out, I believe it did retail for around $100. And when we went to our local Ross a few days ago, I was absolutely flabbergasted. Because when I picked up this Marvel Legends Mjolnir Hammer, I did actually see the price tag, which as you guys can see right there, we got this Marvel Legends Mjolnir for only $34. And 99 cents. Wow! That's a low price! An absolute bargain in terms of this Marvel Legends collectible. We're just going to be opening up this wicked awesome Marvel Legend collectible for all of you guys today. And I can't wait to get into it. It's going to be wicked webtastic. You definitely don't want to miss out on the rest of today's 25 Days of Christmas video. So make sure you guys stick around until the end. Alrighty, and I am super excited. Like I said, Miss Spider Pops and I did find this super awesome Mjolnir Marvel Legend collectible at our local Ross. And I did feel like it would be a fitting video to do on our day 22 video since it is Miss Spider Pops and I anniversary because without Miss Spider Pops, I wouldn't have even seen this. Without fail, pretty much any time I'm out and about looking for something cool that I'm trying to add to the Spider Pops collection, there's a good 80% of the time that I'm not even the one who spots it on the shelf. It's usually Miss Spider Pops. Miss Spider Pops is usually on point with all of that. She is so incredible and caring and just the fact that she's always looking out for stuff that I'm looking for and not always stuff that she's interested in is just something that I'm always incredibly grateful for. And she's actually the one who really encouraged me to pick this up for today's video just because she knew how much I was excited about actually finding it in our local Ross. So without Miss Spider Pops, we probably wouldn't have today's video, especially because I didn't even see it on the shelf until she pointed it out. So definitely a huge thank you for my love, Miss Spider Pops, for helping us find this Marvel Legends Jonathan. All right, and it is going to be a little bit tough to get this Marvel Legends open. As you guys can see, there is tape right there, which does cause issues for your friendly neighborhood Spider Pops. Luckily, we have a solution. It is foretold in the old Marvel Legends manuscripts that in order to get Jonathan out of the box, one must use another Jonathan. So, we do have a Jonathan to get this Jonathan out of the box. Lego Mjolnir has been waiting in our Spider Pops collection for some action for quite some time. Now it's time to get this Marvel Legends Mjolnir out of the box. Let's do this. All right. Behold! Oh, oh 
Odin's son! And that did seem to do the trick. We can go ahead and set our Lego Jonathan aside for now. We got the Marvel Legends Mjolnir open. And now it's time to take it out of the box. Now like I said, this is the Marvel Legends Mjolnir that was modeled from Mjolnir from Thor Love and Thunder. So this is actually the one that was reforged to heal Jane during the course of the movie. So it is definitely really cool. I'm super excited to actually see this. I've seen pictures of this one and videos on my Instagram, but I've never actually seen it in person. And as you guys can see, it's one solid piece. It doesn't look like I have to really put anything together. We'll probably have to put batteries in it at some point, but we will just have to see. Looks like we just got some cardboard there at the bottom. And now we can set that box aside. And there we have it, look at it, right there. As you can see right there, he's let himself go a little bit. He's a little boxy right now, but um, we can fix that. He just has to hit the weights a little bit, a little bit of Thor magic. And there we are, good as new. As you guys can see right there, Jonathan has trimmed down a little bit, but it does look like we gotta get him some batteries. It's okay though, we'll get Odin to charge these up with some Duracells real quick. Alright, and I'm starting to feel the power now. Odin has bestowed upon us the Duracell power of double A, and now we have a functioning Jonathan to show off for all of you guys today for 25 days of Christmas. Oh, that is really cool, honestly. That Just stopped me mid-sentence right there, but... As you guys can see, we did get batteries put into this Mjolnir right here and it is looking really awesome. It's not quite as noisy as the Marvel Legends Stormbreaker that we do actually have right here, and that is actually really awesome. I'm super stoked that I am actually worthy enough to review this Marvel Legends Mjolnir for all of you guys. I was really worried that when I actually got out of the box that I wouldn't even be able to pick it up, but... I'm still worthy. But yeah, this just looks absolutely incredible now that we actually do have the batteries in it. I actually am going to turn off the lights really quick just so you guys can see this in a dark setting. All right. And as you guys can see right there, that looks absolutely insane. As you guys can see, as soon as I turned the lights off, I decided to, to, to turn off for a second. But... <laughs> Now that's some thunder, that is really cool. As you guys can see, that's just for me pushing the button right there. I'm pretty sure every time I push the button, it is going to make... Ooh, looks like it's a different actually. Looks like it's a pretty different sound every single time that you do actually push the button, but it is just absolutely insane. Especially when it does start glowing, I am super stoked that we actually do have this Lego John. I keep calling it a Lego, it's not a Lego. I am super stoked that we do actually have this Marvel Legends Mjolnir and that it does actually look so incredible. And if you guys remember, we did only pay around like $35 for this thing. Normally this would be a $100 collectible right here, but because of Ross's incredibly insane prices on these collectibles, we did only pay $36 for this wicked insane Marvel Legend Mjolnir. I am just incredibly stoked that we were able to get this Wicked Webtastic Marvel Legend collectible and that we were able to show it off for all of you guys for today's 25 Days of Christmas Day 22 video. Huge thank you to Miss Spider Pops for spotting this incredible collectible on the shelves. And once again, huge thank you to Miss Spider Pops for all of the incredible and webtastic things you do for me on a daily basis. I cannot thank you and repay you enough for everything that you do for me. And I can't wait for all of the Wicked Webtastic years that we're going to spend together. But that's pretty much all I got to say about that for today's video. I am super stoked that we were able to go over this wicked awesome Marvel Legend Jonathan for all of you guys today. But that is pretty much going to do it for today's Day 22 video on the Spider Pops channel. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing us go over this Wicked Webtastic collectible. Something I think I forgot to mention really quick before we actually do end this video. Just the detail on... This Mjolnir is, is absolutely incredible. It's like straight out of the movie. The only thing that could possibly make it better is if it was actually made out of metal, but that would make it insanely expensive. So without making it an actual physical working metal hammer, 
this is pretty much as good as it's gonna get because oh goodness gracious goodness gracious Whew. i scared myself just the texture and detail they even have on the wrapping of this Mjolnir is absolutely incredible and I'm so stoked that we actually do have it to add to the Spider Pops collection. But after going over that, that is actually everything that we do have to go over for today's Spider Pops 25 Days of Christmas video. I really do hope you guys enjoyed today's video. And make sure if you guys are new here that you hit that subscribe button with bell notifications turned on so you don't miss out on any of the future webtastic action. But with all that being said, I hope to see you guys bright and early for tomorrow's Day 23 video on the Spider Pops channel. We only have three days left of Spider Pops 25 Days of Christmas Season 4, so make sure you guys are staying safe out there, staying frosty and having fun, of course. Have an amazing rest of your day, webheads. Bye bye <laughs>